Welcome everyone, so today we're going to take a look at Rutherford's gold foil experiment. Now Rutherford carried out this experiment to study the structure of the atom. So what he did was he had some alpha particles here, which are positively charged. And he shoots these alpha particles into a gold foil, which of course has atoms in it. Okay, so we're going to head right into it. Now one of the first things he observes when he shoots these alpha particles into this gold foil is that a few of them bounce back, or in proper terms, deflect by more than 90 degrees. Now, what does this prove? Well, it proves that this atom has a heavy nucleus, which is much smaller than the atom itself. Moving on, the second observation he makes from these alpha particles is that some of them deflect by a small angle. And what does this prove about the atom? Well, it proves that the nucleus in the atom that we saw earlier is also positively charged. So I'm just going to draw a positive sign right here, which explains the small deflection because positive and positive repel each other. Finally, the last observation is that majority of the alpha particles pass straight through the gold foil without any deflection. And this proves that the atom is mainly made up of empty space. And so from this experiment, Rutherford concludes that the atom has a heavy nucleus, which is positively charged, and the atom in general has a lot of empty space. And that's all you need to know.